Alan Trudinato here coming to you from Mikey Stadium at West Point Friday Night Lights. Army Black Knights 28, Oregon State 12. This is Nightcap reviewing a season opening win for Army. At times, I mean, it wasn't pretty, but Army was disciplined today. They had no turnovers and no penalties and got off to a 21 nothing start three minutes into the second quarter. Angel Santiago show in the first half. A junior starting only his second game as an Army quarterback. He threw for 101 yards in the first half. I think Army quarterbacks in the last two seasons have thrown for 100 yards in a game twice. So Angel, first play of the game, rolls out, completes a 20 or so yard pass to freshman wide receiver uh, Xavier Moss, and that kind of got the ball rolling. He got confidence, he had a couple long runs, and uh, Army's offense was really rolling in the first half. Second half after the opening drive touchdown, they struggled. The defense kind of played a little bit better in the second half. They didn't really allow uh, Morgan State inside, deep inside Army's territory. On defense, we're still going to see a little uh, sloppy tackling on tape, um, but they got the job done. Again, some people thought that Army needed to really have a convincing win here against Morgan State to start the season. 30 points, 40 points, but I think the team will take it. They're 1-0. It's a winning streak for Army. They won two games last year, so they're halfway to their win total from last year and uh, all around, they'll, t they'll take the win. Here's what Coach Ellerson had to say about Army's victory. They actually was a chance. If you're gonna have a season, you gotta win the opener, and, and so we fulfilled that, 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 that first condition of success, and, and, our, and we, we enjoy, we're enjoying that. We have an awful lot of respect for our opponent boy. They battled, they battled their tails off. Uh, and uh, there's, that's remarkable, I was, I was just saying there, there to, we had the one punt block, but to play 60 minutes of football like that in the opener, and have no turnovers on either side of the ball is really remarkable. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't think we were penalized, which is again that again some of those things we we were trying to pick a fight about, saying things we were gonna we were gonna make a difference in with our preseason and our approach through the spring and summer. Um, but we validated something. You now that's that's just one time up. You know, but if you can if you don't if you're not penalized much and you don't turn the ball over, you're hard to beat. So um, that's that's a good sign. Um, Angel did some great stuff, and the best thing again, the best thing about Angel's performance was the ball's not on the ground, um, and there were some chances for the ball to be on the ground. He took some shots, so I just was coached up on that, and he, and that's, and that's, and the ball goes through his hands on every snap. So um, that that's that's again that kind of play, quarterback will give you a, a great chance. There'll be all kinds of things he'll do better. Clearly, he's a, he's got quick feet, and he can make some people miss, and he can run. And he made some nice throws. Now there's some throws he'd like back, especially on third and short when you can get, get with your legs. I like that. I you know he and I would both like that one back. But uh, that's a great first outing for him. It's a chance to win the opener. It's a chance that he can he can he can feel great about a lot of the things he did out there, and he can look at some things that he'll 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 do better next time up. Junior quarterback Angel Santiago talks about his outstanding performance. Well, I, I feel like it's going well. You know, there's there's much things that I need to improve on. And again, a lot of the success came from you know receivers making big plays and the whole line really doing the thing up front. So it made my job a lot easier. Uh, absolutely, I think you know we're one of the most disciplined offenses in the country, and uh, we know how to we know how to hang on the football. We know what's right, and it's just a matter of going out there and executing. Army knows it's got to play better next week. They travel to Ball State. Ball State has won the last two years against Army. Keith Wenning has had his way with Army secondary. Army's secondary is supposed to be a little bit improved. Tonight they gave up a couple passes that maybe they should, so they'll be tested. Uh, to go 2-0 and for Army, it's going to take a perfect effort like tonight, but they have to play, play consistent for 60 minutes against Ball State. They can't play a half and expect to win in Muncie next week. For Nightcap, I'm Sal and turn it on.